Well, good evening, everyone, or good morning, or good afternoon, depending on where you are. A very warm welcome, as usual, back to What's for Tina. It's lovely to see you all, and I hope you've managed to get everything that you need for you and your family this week as well. So, yeah, it's another wee Sainsbury's click and collect order. I didn't need that much, so it's not the biggest haul, if you like, in the world, but I spent just under £72. But if you're new and this is your first time here, my name's Cheryl, this is What's for Tea, and it's just a wee look at what I picked up for the family food shop for the week ahead. So if you like these kinds of videos, why not consider subscribing just before you leave? So the first thing I picked up was a wee bag of baby potatoes, just for a change from our big tatties that we have here but I do like you know making mashed tatties especially for things like shepherd's pies and that kind of thing. A wee pot of cream because I do like to add this to cheese sauce and that kind of thing and I'm also going to be doing a carbonara during the week so I got some shaved parmesan just to pop onto the top and that's also nice and normal cheese sauce as well. A few pots of yogurt so we've got the peach, the vanilla and the strawberry and this one is an excellent price. A wee wholemeal loaf but as you'll know by now if you're a regular we don't eat a lot of bread and we also get a milk delivery so yeah no milk. Some parsley and that's the tagliatelle for the carbonara that we're going to be having during the week. This one is lovely, this is a fresh pasta. And we're going to be having haggis, neeps and tatties one night, very Scottish. So this wasn't the one I ordered, this was a substitution, but it's more or less the same. I've never seen these before, so I decided to pick these ones up for me. It's the Ski Smooth Strawberry and a cauliflower, and I thought this looked lovely. And we've been enjoying, you know, cauliflower cheese recently, so I think I'll turn that into cauliflower cheese. And then some pancetta. Again, this is for the carbonara that I'm doing. It's in a convenient wee sort of double pack. So, you, do, you know, you're not wasting any. A couple of Swedes, or as we call them, we just call them turnips. But yeah, a couple of Swedes. And some mushrooms. Again, this is for the carbonara we're having during the week. But, you know, I haven't had carbonara in such a long time. And then some grapes. These are just some red and some green grapes. And then a couple of bags of tender stem broccoli because I haven't had this for a wee while either. Now this wee ready meal I do not remember ordering but it is on the receipt so I must have clicked it by accident. You know it's not something I would have picked up but I'm sure it's going to be lovely. And then a couple of pots of the carbonara sauce and as I said earlier I'll just add in my own pancetta and my own mushrooms, my own parmesan cheese. It's just a nice wee base so I've got two different kinds. And then a couple of fresh soups. These are handy to have, you know, just for a quick lunch or something. If it's just going to be me and Mr. What's for Tea, sometimes we have soup and rolls and I'll just use one of them. Got quite a few green bananas and also some hot cross buns as well. I've been getting these the last few weeks and Mr. What's for Tea enjoys them. I'm not a fan. And then some jazz apples and some gravy pots. These are handy for the pantry, you know, if you don't have any of your own gravy. A big box of fruit and fibre. Again, Mr. What's for Tea is the only one that likes that. And then some custard. Again, I like to keep this in the pantry and it was half price. We're going to be having a fish pie. I've never used this kind of thing before, but I've seen other people with this in their shopping halls and they say it's okay. So I'm going to give it a wee go because I would normally buy fresh fish from the local fishmonger. But yeah, that's just super convenient. A couple of boxes of Mr. Watts for Tea's favourite biscuits. These are £1.60, down to a pound just now, so bargain. A couple of jars of cayenne pepper, because I go through this stuff like pepper. <laughs> a bottle of Fry Light for frying. And a bag of flour, because I was just about out of plain flour. Jasper's cat food, and this is the one that he likes, or he's been liking for the last few months. And then some dishwasher tablets because I'm down to about two of them. So yeah, needed these. And then a bag, a bag of Jasper's toilet stones, we call them. But yeah, cat litter. And that's the one that he enjoys standing all over. So that was our wee shopping haul this week. Like I said, I really didn't need that much, but I do have bits and bobs to pick up from the local butcher. I've placed an order and I think it's just under £30 and it's just some minced beef and chops and things like that that I prefer to get from the local butcher. I just think it tastes a wee bit nicer and the price isn't that much more. But just before I move on, I wanted to say a big thank you as usual to the supporters of the channel over on my Patreon and to the new Patreons. Welcome 
time and thank you very much and to the channel members here on YouTube as well. And for those who have been asking about Jasper and you're missing seeing him at the end of the videos, this was him about 10 minutes ago and as usual in his favourite spot at this time of night on the sofa next to me on his blanket, all cuddled in and falling asleep. I think he sleeps about 80% of the time. So yeah, that's him doing what he loves, having a snooze. So yeah, he's absolutely fine and he's a very happy wee cat. So for those of you who have asked, there he is. So thank you all for watching. If you're still here at this point, it's very much appreciated, you know, and it does blow my mind that after, yet what, three years now, I've been uploading videos to YouTube and we buy more or less the same things every week, you know, and we have more or less the same meals every week. You know, there's a slight rotation, but it's basically the same things. But you're always here and you always come back to see what I'm up to. So it is very much appreciated because, you know, I wouldn't be where I am just now if you guys weren't out there watching my wee videos so as long as you're enjoying them and watching them I will be here to post them for you it's like a wee extended family I think so yeah thank you very much and until I see you next which is going to be tomorrow with a wee snack surprise box unboxing hopefully I'll see you then but whenever you choose to join me again take care of yourselves and I'll see you off a soon back here on what's for tea so take care and bye for now bye now <laughs>